What's going on YouTube? This is 903 Fishing. Very excited about today's trip. And I'm gonna tell you why. Look who is in the boat with me. What's up guys? I got Cole from Cole and Jay on YouTube. And I finally got him down here to Texas to try to get on these Texas slabs. We're gonna be slip corking live minnows over the top of brush tops. We already have a few in the live well right now, but we're gonna try to fill that sucker up today. And in Texas right now, it's hot, it's humid. These crappie are on brush anywhere from 12 to 20 feet of water. And what we're gonna do today is we're gonna bounce from brush top to brush top. You ready to get on? I'm ready, dude, I'm excited. I love fishing in Texas, I love fishing in the Texas heat, and I love fishing crappie, so it's a perfect combination for a good day. We're about to get on them for you guys. If you haven't, go ahead and smash that like button. It really helps out the channel. And if you're already subscribed to the channel, God bless you. Y'all know I would not be doing this without you guys. Thank you for liking, sharing, commenting. Means the world to me. Thank y'all so much. If you haven't hit that subscribe button, you love crappie fishing, smash that subscribe button. Come join the family. And also go check out Cole and Jay. Hey man, I meant to tell you congrats on a quarter million subs. Thank you. Yeah, everyone, I didn't even, I didn't even realize Dude. it happened. I started getting messages like, it's exciting. It's kind of just a quarter million on. subs over there, guys. Of course, I'm going to have the link to his channel in the description of this video. He does just about everything over there. If you like a variety of fishing, this dude's channel right here is the bomb. Y'all be sure to go check it out. But we're about to get on these crappie for you guys. You ready to go? I'm ready, dude. Let's get them. Y'all stay tuned. Let me go to the old honey hole. That place turned on, though. Like after, after you and I went. Yeah. You got any? Uh, you use the pinch with these pliers? You use those pliers. There he is, bro. Get that guy. There he is. Oh, yeah. There we go. That's the first fish of the day, guys. That's a good one, too. First fish of the day. Had to go a little deeper on the pile than I would want to. I'm not even rigged up. Not even rigged Cole up. Cole has jet lag, he says, right? Yeah, I got jet lag. Not even rigged up. <laughs> My man's already out here. <laughs> Dropping 12 and a half inches in the boat. <laughs> Let's go, baby. <laughs> All right. So I had to go deep, man. 13 feet. Yeah. Uh, I had to... Those bluegill typically sit above the crappie. Yeah. So if I'm getting bluegill bit, then I'll just keep going deeper. I'm gonna catch the buoy. Oh, it happens. Two pounder at the same time. It, oh, there he is. First cast. Are you serious? First cast, baby. Crappie. First cast. It is. Oh. It is a crappie. Your first cast in Texas today, man. Yeah. Look, look at that black. <laughs> <laughs> Got a little jet lag, but we got a we got about an 11 inch or first cast. Hey man, we'll take it. That's awesome. Look at that, guys. First cast out here, East Texas. <laughs> got myself a nice. It's thick too. Uh, that's a good black that's crappie. A thick, healthy summer crappie. First yes, sir. cast. First hey, cast. Hey man, that sucker demolished it. We'll take it. He really did demolish. That was amazing. That was gone. Caleb's already got one in here, so we've got two now. <laughs> that's awesome. So I got me another minnow. I usually like to hook them right below the dorsal fin. Some people like hooking them in the eyes. Where do you like to hook them? I thread mine on. What do you mean thread them on? I thread them on. Like a worm? Yes, sir. Oh, and you just, you just because play. because of the bluegill. I got you. I got you. Um, because if you're if you're doing it like that through the tail or the back of the you know the back. Yeah. Man, they'll they'll just one swipe. That's I mean, true. They've been taking mine off even if I'm threading them. So almost every single pile today is gonna have bluegill on it with them. Another Are one. You serious. Another one. My, Second cast. My guy over here. Oh, ooh, ooh, yeah. ooh. White crappie. Let's go. White crappie. Let's go. That's what I'm talking about, man. What's wrong with that? That's a keep. Nothing wrong with that one. Where's your bobber? Oh, there it is. That's a keeper, too. <laughs> hey, I'm two for two. I can just stop today. I can You'd tell, be a I thousand can, percent. Yeah, I'm a thousand. I can tell Jay I caught a few fish every one of my casts today. <laughs> I got enough for I got enough for four sandwiches and we're good. That is like, awesome. I was like, there's probably nothing in there right now except for some brim, some tiny bass. There he is. Oh, yeah. that's a good one. That's a, that's a big guy. Ooh. Oh yeah. There we go. On the board. Back on the board. I, I, 
thought I had a two fish lead on Cole, but that guy right there just <laughs> first two casts. He did, he wasn't playing around, putting them in there. Let's go. Nice. Oh, oh yeah. he big. Oh, he is he? Oh yeah, nice one. Woo! Yeah, nice man. That's what I'm talking about. He's in the boat. He's in it, baby. <laughs> Let's go. There we go. I caught two of my first two casts, and then uh, it's been about 10 casts later, got my third fish. Another nice little white crappie. Let's go, baby. Look Let's there, guys. go. Up to three. I think it's All three, right. three in there. It now. is, man. He even gave me a head start, guys. Yeah, but they were like, oh, we're going to bring it, and you have to. My man. Get him. Got him. Oh, oh. Get up here. Oh, that's a. Mm. Oh, yeah. We'll take that off day, Cole. Y'all got some thick summertime crappie out here. Thick, baby. Oh, look. Your bobber's gone. Oh, bobber's gone. We're doubling. Doubled up. Hey, hey that's a big one. That's a big one. Ah, uh, if you say so. Uh, you want to compare? I think. They look like twins. <laughs> they, do. they do, man. Look at that. You're missing. Yours has got a chunk of the snapping turtle. It does. That look one. at there. Hey, guys. Doubling up in Texas, baby. Let's go. Good fish. Here you go. And then look, see that that minnow? I'll just throw it right back out there. You should be money right there. Where you're at? You are. Yeah. Mine bit it right closer to the boat. Got, Got him. him. Second brush piles, money. Let's go. Oh, it's a good keeper. I oh, think. Yeah. Yes, sir, it yes. is. That's a keeper, for sure. Nice white crappie. I think we've we caught all white crappie except for that one that I nice. caught earlier. Hey, what, what ACC are you using? It's the eight footer. Eight, oh, so we're both, hey, we're both eight foot and eight foot. super no, grip, it's, baby. It's the only way to go with the flip fork. Super grip. It really is the only I'm telling way to go you guys, the I love it. What's going on, family? I want to take a break from the fishing action and go over our setups. Of course, y'all already know we got the ACC crappie sticks, but Cole and I are both using the eight footer with our super grips. I love this tacky feel on this rod. Y'all be sure to go check out acccrappiesticks.com. Then on the other end, we have the Carbon X2 from PC Fun right here. Y'all be sure to go check out pcfun.com. Use code 903fish15 to save you 15% off your order. We have the 10 pound Power Pro braid. And then we have my slip cork set up, guys. I will link how to rig this slip cork set up at the end of this video. Y'all be sure to go check it out. But this setup right here is gonna catch a crappie year round, especially when we're fishing these deeper brush tops here. You can float that live minnow, you know, 15, 20 feet down into that brush top. And these crappie just can't resist that live minnow. But we're going to get back to fishing. Y'all stay tuned. Oh. That's not, is that, is that a crappie? What you got? You got a catfish? No. Oh. Oh, it's a little crappie. Nice. Oh, there we go. That's a good slab. Good fish right there. There you is. Keep me mad at Let's that. Let's go, baby. 12, 12 and a half, probably. Take that all day, guys. All day. Now, I told Cole we're going to run into some big ones. Just be a little patient. We're going to go get them. Mm, got him, brother. Got him. Uh oh. What does that feel like? Catfish. No, what? <laughs> Just kidding. It's a nice one. Oh, dude, that's a big one. You gonna boat flip him? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yes, that's what I'm talking about. <laughs> that's what I'm talking about. That is a hammer. Hammer. That's hammer a hammer, hammer, man. Yeah, mouth. Oh yeah. Yes, sir. You gonna take him real quick? Let's, you're gonna wipe him? I can do him in this camera. Yeah, for sure, for sure. It may go out this way. I don't know. One way to find out. There he is. Ooh. Oh, that's a that's a tank. It feels like a oh, oh. oh, boat flip. Oh, well, let's go. <laughs> let's go. Oh man, smoked it. Look at that crappie right there, guys. It's big guy. Let's go. Well, there is a good fish. That's what we want. Let's go. That's what I'm about. Hey man, we're getting a little bag in the live well, brother. Oh, 
There he is. There he is. Just to the right of that buoy. Uh oh, black. It's a nice black crappie. Take that. I still got that minnow. It's gonna be a keeper fish, guys. I accidentally caught a catfish a while ago. I don't know if y'all gonna see that, but reeled in the marker on accident and kind of having to get our bearings back on where that brush pile is. But this one is sitting. Hey man, that's 11. 11. Just short of 11 right Big there. Dog. Nice. All right, guys, let's go. before it didn't seem very blue gilly. What kind of fish is that? Oh, snap. That is a crappie. Oh, That's snap. close to a keep. I'm going to let him go, though. I'm going to let that one go. Still got that minnow. Toss right back out there. Oh. There he is. Oh, that's a, another crappie. It is. Man, that's man. probably a keep. Man, it's not a giant fish, but... Let's see what he's looking like. I'm curious. Ten and a quarter. Ten and a quarter? Um, I didn't look at it. Oh, dude, eleven. Ten and a quarter. Okay. You were right the first time. <laughs> Ten and a quarter. It's a keeper all day, baby. We're gonna take a break from the fishing action, and uh, we're gonna help these uh, these people right here. Their boat that they were testing out died on them right in the middle of the lake. They flagged us down, and uh, we're gonna go ahead and give them a tow into the marina right here. So it's a great example of when you can help somebody out, help them out. I know if that was me in that position, I would want some help too. So always help when you can. All right, guys. Well, we have dropped off the boat at the marina, and now we are back to our piles. We actually went ahead and left. <laughs> we left our buoys in the water here. We're going to get back to fishing. Let's see what we can do. Oh, yeah. There he is. Oh, yeah. Oh, there's a keep. Good one. Ooh. That's a no measurement needed right there. Not at all. Not at all, baby. Good fish. That's what I'm talking about. There you go, guys. No measurement needed. Mm. You try to keep me out of this spot. I can just do it. <laughs> I can just do it. <laughs> that ain't it, man. That's exactly what you're doing. <laughs> He said, throw over at that buoy over there and see if there's any fish in it. I'm just going to keep fishing over here, catching all these crappie. Oh, gosh. It's loaded. I got to cast. Now I'm trying to cast block you. Look at me. I'm no, not even on it. Yeah, you are. You should get bit right there. Oh. He's on him. He's on him thick. Uh oh, that's a better one, I think. Oh yeah, that's a good one. Good black crappie. Take that all day. I think that's gonna keep my man. For little sure. little double up. What's up? Sure. You would be. I think you're too deep, man. I might be a little too deep. I'm only 11 feet. Hey man, almost 11. Let's go, baby. Well, family, I tell you what. We're struggling a little bit right now. Just a little bit. Just a little bit. But uh, the, the Texas heat will do that to you sometimes. It will. You get you all um, hot and bothered and fish start acting weird. And I'm telling you. You go to one brush pile and not catch fish and that's it. Right. Or <laughs> go to a brush top, catch one or two, and then you're it's it's done. And we've, we've been seeing fish on the brush tops, guys. They're just, 
I think they're just so lethargic, man. They're just not biting. They're a little finicky, but I, I'm optimistic that we'll find another pile with some that are angry. And one day some minutes. Yeah, for uh, sure. Let's go get For it. sure. 100%. Got him? My dragon's so loose. It's ooh, a nice crappie. Ooh, there you go. Get up here. Why is my drag so loose? I don't know, man. That's crazy. There we go. There's another one. Nice. Okay. Go. Oh. Got him. Oh, oh that's ooh, a good you one see the mouth? You see the mouth come up out of that thing? Yeah. Dang man. Yeah, I thought I had the brush pile snag for a second. Let's go. Another one. Two in a row. That's the exact same size. These are all just perfect size fish. They are. The last pile we fished, we caught two off it right off the bat. Oh, it's bite. Got him. This time we got three. Get him. How's that good? Stud? Stud. Stud. Oh, yeah. There we go. Get some quality. There we go. The last pile had a little bit smaller fish. Back nice. on track where we started this morning. Nice. Did you get on the left side? No, I hadn't got bit on the left. I just went to the left because you're on the right. Ah, yeah. Oh, that's a, mm, that looks good. Oh, oh we're doubling. doubling. We doubling, baby. Doubling. This might be a big one. Oh, it is. Oh yeah. Double trouble. One, two, three. Oh. I'm really flipping you so big. Hey man, that's a, that's a good. What are we doing? What are we we're doing? We're sword here? fighting. What are we doing here? <laughs> I don't know if mine gonna keep. Man, how the thing, how the tables have turned. Hey guys, can y'all tell the difference between a black crappie? and a white crappie. Cole has the white, I got the black right here. And you know what? They're chilling on the same brush top, baby. Yep, let us know in the comments if you know the difference. Nice, man. Here's your keeper. You think so? Yeah, so. It's gotta be 10, though. He's 10. He's a line burner, 10. A line burner. Oh, yeah. dude, that's almost 11. I know, he's a nice one. I, I this, think... one this one's just so big. Okay, yeah, all right. <laughs> what, what is it now? This is uh, probably a 14. Yeah, got to be. Probably 14. A little hey, guys, that's again. 11, and that's a big one right there, baby. Let's go. Here we go. Let's try to get a little cast-to-catch action here. Oh, oh, there you there he is. Got him. My man got him. Oh, that's a good one. That's a good one. A good one? Yeah, that's a good oh, one. Oh, goodness. Look yeah. At that. Let's go. Hey, good job, buddy. There we go. Nice little white crappie right there, guys. That's a beautiful one. Let's go, baby. Nice. Hey, guys. Good fish on this pile right now. Good fish. Let's see if we can go get some more. There. Got him. Kind of let marinate out there a little while. How does he feel? Oh, oh, oh. yeah. ACC boat flip. Gotta love it. Let's go, baby. Let's go. Gotta love it. This pile's got biggins. It does. It's man. got Look at that one. That's a good fish. Look at the colors. Beautiful. Look at the bars. Beautiful, man. Dang, that was nice. Get him, 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 all right, guys, another one going in the well, baby. Uh-oh. Call some fish in there. We're messing around and getting a few. We're messing around. Let's see how many more we can get. Dang, there was quite a bit on there. It looks like it. Oh. There he is. There he is. Out of the boat. Oh, oh that's a big dude. Get him. I think. Get him. Oh, get him. Oh, yeah. Big slab. Oh, let's go. Hey. 13 feet. 
Was fishing at 12, didn't get bit, went down to 13. Boom. Boom. Let's go. Plenty more where that came from. Hey guys, just pulled this one out, baby. Let's go. That's you got, one. is it 13 feet? Yeah. Oh, did mouth. you see the mouth that on mouth. that fish, man? Getting, oh. oh, had to go a little deeper. What do you think about that? I swallowed it. God, it. oh, look at that. Oh, let's go. That's a that's a that's a good fish, man. What's going on, family? Well, guess what, guys? It's probably what 95 degrees outside right now. At least it's probably 95 degrees. Probably heat index over 100. I would imagine. We're about to head back to the boat ramp, and uh, we're gonna see how many fish we got. Do you have any idea? You have an estimate? 30. About 30. 30. That's my guess. Straight up, 30 on the dot. 30. I'm gonna say 28. Dang it. I'm going to say 28. I'm going to lowball him. I'm going to lowball it. But guys, I hope you all have enjoyed this video so far. Right now is a great time to hit that like button. And also smash that subscribe button. If you're not subscribed to the 903 Fishing Channel, I greatly appreciate it. We're about to head back to the boat ramp. We'll see you all here in a bit. Y'all stay tuned. What's going on, family? Cole and I are back at the boat ramp. And here is our haul of fish today. 33 keeper crappie. All right, all over... I don't think we kept one under what, 10 and a quarter, 10 and a half? Yeah. About 10 and a half inches. So uh, we did really well today. And this was our weapon of choice, as always, eight foot ACC crappie sticks. This is my favorite slip cork and rod. Of course, paired with the PC Fun Carbon X 1000 right here. Be sure to go to PCFun.com, use code 903FISH15 to save you 15% off of your order. They also have the Viper X over there. And that is the green and black one that's gonna match this ACC really well. We fished brush tops today anywhere from 13 to 20 feet of water and it was a tough bite as that sun got higher it was tougher but the early morning bite and then the later in the afternoon bite seemed to really pick up for us but we had to move around a lot today and sometimes that's what you got to do summer crappie fishing find those active fish find those crappie that are going to bite. Woo Cole! Man! Man. This is our second time fishing together. And we're two for two. We're two for two, baby. Um, I think I'm gonna link our first video. I went up to uh, Lake Conway and fished. I'm gonna link that video at the end of this video. Y'all be sure to go check that out. But hey man, I greatly appreciate it. I had to get him on some Texas crappie. Ever since I went up there to Conway, I had a lot of people telling me I, I had to get Cole down here in East Texas on these Texas slabs. What'd you think? Ah oh, man, it was a great time. You know, I used to come out to this part of the country a lot when I was younger, but it's been a few years since I came out here targeting crappie. So just to get, get to come out here today and, and wreck on some slabs, it brought back a lot of fond memories and made That's some awesome. new ones today. Got a lot of big slabs on tailgate and uh, they're gonna feed a lot of people. If you enjoyed today's video, smash that like button. YouTube loves when you like, and go ahead and leave me a comment down in the comment section. I greatly appreciate it. If you're subscribed to the channel already, God bless you. Y'all know I would not be doing this without you guys. If you love crappie fishing and you also wanna learn these different types of techniques to catch crappie, we catch crappie year round here on the 903 Fishing Channel. And don't forget, Cole and Jay, be sure to go check out his channel. He does it all over there, okay? I mean, I don't know a species of fish that he that you have not caught. There's a few that I haven't, but they're kind of they're kind of random ones. I'm I'm telling you, want to check them off. Go check out Colin J on YouTube. He does a variety of fishing guys and very informational and entertainment over there. Y'all be sure to go check him out. Like always, like, comment, and subscribe to 903 Fishing. Y'all have a great day. God bless.